Good morning from New York. It is Wednesday and we are just about to go out and film with Martha Stewart's crew. Um, so we're getting ready over there. Look at her there. Hello. Um, I have got up. It's I got up really early because it was about like five o'clock in the morning and um, jet lag has really hit. I've do started doing this uh, Headspace. I've got this Headspace app and um, so I've been doing meditation, which is uh, pretty cool. And you do like 10 minutes every day, 10 to 15 minutes every day. And it's quite cool. It keeps me very zen. And I followed it up with some stretching and some yoga. And now I feel fully awake. So we're gonna go down and get some breakfast. We're staying in the Ace Hotel and uh, the breakfast is pretty darn good here. Is it good? Yeah. Looks good. And I've got some uh, fruit with yogurt and honey. We're just waiting for our Uber outside the hotel and um, it's very, very hot today. We're wearing the shorts, we're wearing the shirts. And so we've got our shirts, uh, shorts and shirts on. Hi, hi. Uh, yeah, she's looking very summery, and uh, we're just waiting for our car, which should be here any minute. So we're here, we're at Martin Stewart's office. So cool. Big sign there. Look at the view. This is like right in Chelsea, and uh, you get a great view of the river. But it's a really light and airy place, and very, very cool. I feel like I have to keep my voice down just in case they hear me. But uh, I'm now gonna rob a magazine. I don't know if I'm allowed to rob a magazine, but I'm planning to. Look. Over here is where we shoot. This is where we're shooting with Donald for his channel, which is kind of fun. I don't know if you've ever done something in someone else's kitchen. This is here, and then if you look over here, this is where we keep all of our stuff. So we have all the equipment that we use for the for the shoes and everything sort of set there so we can pull it in whenever we need it. So not so pretty. Not pretty. So pretty <laughs> I mean, useful. Useful. And it's good to see that this is like a lot of stuff goes into making these segments, which probably happens to Donald too, but we're a little crazy here. Like we've got a lot mm. of stuff. And then over here, <clears throat> is the, um, the, the famous stove that I cook at. <laughs> the stove that I usually do all of my cooking on, and we set up a camera right over there in the corner so that I'm talking straight to a camera. It's an um, yeah. so, so also pretty, that's Michelle. She's Michelle. awesome. She's doing our prep today. Um, isn't she gorgeous? She is, and she's Brazilian yeah, as well. She's Brazilian, which is just like Irish. Right just like Irish she's people, yeah. <laughs> But like, not only do you have this kitchen, but you have yeah. this giant kitchen yeah. as well, which is quite cool. Back there is another giant kitchen where we do all of our developing and testing and prepping for our shoots and creating content for the magazines, Martha Stewart Living, Martha Stewart Weddings, all of it. Stuff that you see on my show, Everyday Food, and Thomas Joseph's Kitchen Conundrums. We get that stuff going in there, and it's like a big, fun laboratory for plants. Really great. Yeah. So we've just finished filming our first recipe with the lovely Sarah from Everyday Food and we're setting up for her recipe which is going to be on my channel which is a delicious chocolate cake. So there is chocolate cake coming your way. Maybe you're not going to like it. Yeah. I, it's chocolate cake. It's not going to like it. Alright, so, so tell me what we need to do. Together. Uh, we start with the sugar. Three, wait, nope. One and a half cups. All so the sugar. we are filming our so we are filming our second recipe at the moment. We're kind of halfway through it. We're doing a chocolate cake, and Sarah I has laid down the gauntlet. Come I'm on! I'm too busy what? Instagramming. She's... I can't do your vlog. Come on! I'm Instagramming a picture of you, by the uh, way. Uh, uh. Uh, can you see it? Yeah, kind of. Yeah. So yeah, you, you need to check out uh, Sarah's Instagram, which is uh, Sarah Carey One. That's it. That's it. That's it. Yeah. She's so down with the kids. She's been periscoping, <laughs> no, Snapchatting. <I> <laughs> doing either of those things, but Donald's going to teach me all about it, and then maybe well, I'll I, I haven't technically Periscope, but I am Snapchatting, so... Periscope sounds weird. It does sound weird. If, if you need us to be on Periscope, please let us know. Yeah, let us know. <laughs> and Donald will do it, and I will not. We're here together. I'm on Donald's channel, finally. Yes. So exciting. I know, it is. Actually, it's going to happen again, right? It's, oh, it has to happen yeah. again. If I get to come to this beautiful kitchen Actually, again. I really want to come to your kitchen. You should so yeah, come to Dublin. Coming. It's not as nice as this, but... I don't yeah. care. Okay. I've never been to Ireland. Then you've got to come to yeah. Ireland. Yeah. He's invited me. He's yeah. paying. It's That's what that means. Hang on a second. <laughs> no, do. You do. Okay. She's so good at the measurements. Really good. 
<laughs> Nora, you know I what it's like. I'm just doing this to impress people. Is it working? It's, I'm impressed. We have just finished filming this fantastic oh, chocolate cake. I don't know if you can see it, but there it is. And Sarah, I'm so glad that you shared it with me. Thank you so much. I hope that everybody really loves it. I think they're going to. I think it's going to go down extremely well. Chocolate cake always does well. So you have to wait around. Um, it's going to be coming in August. So, yeah, I think yeah. around the middle. middle of August. Yeah, so check it out. It's on the way. On the way. We are on our way to Chelsea Market next. Um, I have a meeting there and we're gonna have some lunch, so um, say goodbye to the big Martha Stewart sign. It was so much fun and Sarah is so lovely. We made a brilliant chocolate cake and we made lemon drizzle slices on my on their channel with my recipe. It's all very confusing, but yes, it's a really cool collaboration. I'm very excited to see how it comes out. So uh, we're going to Chelsea Market, we're gonna grab some lunch and then I've gotta go back because we've gotta pick up the footage and then after that, we're gonna have a little bit of a wander before we do the rehearsal for the Today Show, which is happening this afternoon at about half four. So yeah, that's what's happening. We just had lunch in Chelsea Market and now we are walking around and having a bit of a look around. There's some really cool food places here. So uh, yeah, there's a lady sharpening a knife over there. Yeah, yeah, she's sharpening knives. So we're about to go back to the High Line and have a little bit of a walk up there because it's yeah. pretty nice there. And basically wait around until the rehearsal for the Today Show. So this is the High Line Park and if you've never been to New York, this is the place to go, especially in the summertime when it's all nice and green like this. A uh, really cool place that has basically been redeveloped from an old railway track or an old railway line into this really cool public space and there's all sorts of great things to see here and some really good food as well so you've got to check it out. So we've just arrived for the rehearsals for the Today Show and we are at the Rockefeller Centre. It is a very cool place and I'm going to go through these doors. Here we go. Whee! Yeah, um, so we're going downstairs and we just pick up our passes and then go up and do our rehearsal. I've been here before but it always makes me very confused. And here we go. Okay, so this is the studio. All looking very nice. Look at all the cameras. It's always quite exciting when we come here. But I think there's someone around the corner. Let's say hello. Hello. How are you? We've just done a rehearsal and run through of what we're going to be cooking through, which is the beetroot risotto. And you can see all our lovely equipment laid out here. Oh, very nice. The guy's there. Hi, hi. <laughs> so, uh, yes, we're ready to go now. So they're kicking me out because they've got hot dogs to set up for. So, it's some time. <laughs> this is the tiniest escalator we've been ever on. It's just very, very skinny. Um, yeah, so rehearsal went pretty well. We, uh, we oh, 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 no, hang on, we're in the tiny, <laughs> we both went into the tiny little thing. <laughs> oh, that was exciting. So, uh, yeah, the rehearsal just went really well, and uh, I know what I'm doing. Um, the problem with these these, um, these demos is that you only have, like, four minutes to get your recipe done. So um, there's, there's quite a tight amount of time, but uh, I think we're going to get through it. We've got three recipes that are going to be seen one of them is going to be cooked through. So now we have time, it is roasting hot in New York and uh, I think we're going to try and go downtown. Or are we downtown now? No. No. We're, we're going down the town, if you know what I mean. And we're going to try and go and get some food. Something yes. for dinner. Yeah. I've just had dinner in one of my favorite restaurants in New York. It's Cafe Habana and they do the best Mexican grilled corn with cheese and chili and what else? Fish tacos. Fish tacos. Shrimp we had tacos. shrimp tacos. And um, yeah, it's a really cool place, but basically they do the best corn. And I forgot to take a video of the corn, but I did remember to take a video of the tacos and they are some seriously good tacos. They're kind of smoky and sweet and nice and crispy and fresh as well. So they're really, really tasty. And now we are finished. We've had our dinner and we're gonna get an early night. We're just walking home after an extremely long day. We haven't been back to the hotel yet and I think we're both extremely tired. Yeah. 
Um, so it's been an extremely long day, but we have um, lots more to do tomorrow. We are going to the Today Show on NBC first thing in the morning, so I'm going to get a good night's sleep tonight. Um, and I'm not too nervous because I've done it before, and hopefully I won't be too nervous tomorrow. But tomorrow, after the Today Show, we are going to LA, and next stop is VidCon. So we're going to be at VidCon for Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. I'm very, very excited for VidCon. Tomorrow is our last day, so make sure that you hit subscribe, like, and comment. See you soon.